Hello there. Welcome back to Jack McRobbie after nearly two years. I think it's worth actually mentioning it, because I, I think half of the videos on this channel are just, hey, I'm going to mention the fact that I've taken time off. But this is special, because it's been nearly two years. There's been a calendar year in which I haven't turned up. And that's stupid. It's partially because I've moved, partially because I haven't had the technology to do so for a while, then I've just fallen out of touch, been busy, it's a night. Anyway, today I'm going to be talking about lights, and very specifically the lights behind me that, yes, this video's title is a pun, this video's title is Light Entertainment. But, it's more specifically talking about my relationship with the concept of light. I like very specific lighting on room night. You can see that I've got this lovely Alba angle points lamp that I bought back in 2016 in my first year of uni. It's kind of in all over the place of me. The light over there is a five pound lamp from Ikea. And on the chest of drawers there, there is a Math Moss blue and green in a kind of 1960s copper lava lamp. That was a really nice investment. But very specifically, today I am talking about lights through my window. This, in comparison to the old room I was in, is a south facing room, and that means you will get a lot of light. And I have a lot of things on shelves in this room, and I am scared that they will be destroyed by the amount of light. So I end up limiting the amount of light that's in here during the daytime. I do not like that. I cast the, the sun itself for its capability to destroy. The sunlight is worryingly bright in here during the daytime. I have blinds now. They are nice. They do not completely block out the sun, and they do also not block out the street light just outside of here. During the night time, they are still shining through. They are still shining through. Although, it's gotten a little bit better, because I think like in the first week of having these blinds up, they have changed it from LED street lights. LED street lights, I find, if you look up at them, they kind of diffract into the LEDs themselves. But I'm lit by LEDs at this very moment. There is one on my camera. I like that. I like LED lights. I like LED lights a lot. They have more of a kind of nighttime glow. Like when the first time I noticed there was a new street light up, I didn't quite notice it. I thought it was just oh, it has the kind of glow of nighttime. It's less intense than the older style of street light. But yeah, whatever I do, unless I get some curtains or something, I do have or just not. Up. I will always get light in here, but on the plus side, it keeps things off. I do end up keeping it so dark in here sometimes that I'm just like, I need to get out of here and actually go into the light. Because while I may have kind of crazy complexion, I'm slightly too scared of the light for my own good. Not gonna not gonna become full hermit just yet. Not a vampire. Haha, <laughs> Jonathan is not banging my daughter. Anyway, nice to be back here. Thank you very much. Hope you've enjoyed watching. Have a nice day.